Today on Big C TV, it's the first episode of 2011. Oh yeah. What's up ladies and gents? Welcome to Big C TV. This is episode 3 of the new series of Big C TV. Today's episode I'm just going to go over a few things. Um, basically what's been going on since Christmas, which was when we did the last episode. So, for starters, New Year's was pretty good. Um, welcome to 2011, by the way. I know it's a great year. It's going to be a great year for myself, hopefully, and uh, for Big C TV because this is our first full year under the new format. So we'll see how it goes. Hopefully, we'll keep the episodes rolling. Um, so New Year's pretty good. I was working, unfortunately. That's one of the unfortunate aspects of working at Disney World is uh, you have to work during holidays for the most part. I was very lucky to get Christmas off. Um, I had to work Thanksgiving, and I had to work New Year's Eve, and no, not New Year's Day, New Year's Eve. Um, so yeah, I spent the new year inside the Splash Mountain Tower, um, making sure people weren't jumping on vlogs. So yeah, that was fun. Um, speaking of Splash Mountain, it's currently closed for refurbishment. It will not be reopening it until... February 1st, 2011. So until then, I am back at Epcot working at Mission Space. Awesome. So it's nice to be back at Epcot. Um, getting a good amount of hours there, which is great. I'm glad to be getting some hours. Really not that much is going on besides that. Classes start next week. Um, still in the process of finalizing all of my classes. Hopefully I can get that done really soon since classes start Monday um but I'm working on it so I uh, think should be going well anyway um so that's pretty much all that's going on in my life now we're going to go to show off some stuff I just picked up on recent purchases take it away recent purchases okay so I just got back from Walmart, um, got paid today, pretty good check, this was my New Year's week check, so I got around 300 bucks, and I figured, you know, I'd, I'd splurge a little, especially because I went to Walmart yesterday, in fact, a whole bunch of stuff was really cheap on discount, because they're still trying to get rid of all the Christmas stuff, and it's clearance time, so I picked up a couple games and some other random stuff, so I'm going to show some of that off to you. Start off with this stuff. This stuff isn't really anything spectacular, but it's nice and cheap, and I figured, you know, why not show it off? So, this is After Christmas Candy. We got gingerbread bark, we got cookies and cream bark. Those are pretty good. I had the cookies and cream bark um, before Christmas, so that was pretty good. That was quite tasty. We've got Holiday Bark, which is milk chocolate with red and green candies in it. That looks pretty interesting. I've got Mint Cookie Bark. That sounds pretty good too. And last but certainly not least, we have Peppermint Bark Bites. And Peppermint Squares. So yeah, normally those are each, I think, four bucks. Got them each for a dollar, because they're 75% off. Yay, after Christmas sales. That's pretty good. Um, your local Walmart might have some of that stuff too, so take a look. Next up. Um, ironically enough, they were also having a sale on some liquor. So... I decided to go to the liquor store and pick up some stuff. So uh, I'm gonna get mostly for mixing. I'm not a really big straight liquor 
drinker. But um got it mostly for mixing, so we'll see what I can come up with with these. But uh good good quality stuff. First we got a nice bottle of chocolate vodka. That should be interesting. Next we have a bottle of vanilla vodka. I figure you know. I mean vodka's good for mixing and stuff, so might as well get a couple different flavored ones. Next, I got a drink that I haven't tried yet, so it'll be interesting to see how this is. It could be a complete bust, but we'll find out. I got some orange twisted gin. I have not had gin, so it should be interesting to see how it tastes. That's orange gin. I also got a bottle of raspberry gin. Now, all four of those were discounted pretty heavily. I mean, the gin, I think, is was six bucks for a bottle. And then the, both the vodkas, I think, were around 10, something like that. The last thing I got, I got because my friend, my former roommate, uh, told me it was really good, and I ha don't actually have a bottle of rum to uh, add to my liquor cabinet. So, I got this stuff. Captain Morgan Private Stock. I've heard it's really good. We'll find out. So, yeah, that's my little like a collection that I got today. I also got some random stuff for school, which I don't want to bore you with. And some socks. I got a new backpack. I'll show you that. Looks a lot like my old one, but uh, it's lighter blue. Last thing, which I know most of my GameSpot fans, whoa, mini earthquake thing. Um, most of my GameSpot fans are going to be kind of excited about are a couple games I got. Now, the interesting thing about these is they're pre-owned games from Walmart, which I did not know that Walmart did pre-owned games until recently. Apparently they do. I don't know if they do them in all stores, so we'll see. But um, I picked both of these up for $8 each, which I think is a pretty good deal when you consider what they are. First one up is Overlord 2 for 360 and this one's still sealed too. If you notice, sealed. So I'm pretty sure this has never been opened. And the next one, which it wouldn't shock me if this one wasn't open either, but I haven't checked the disc, so I don't know for sure. Mad World for Wii. So yeah, I got two games, eight dollars each. Um, pretty content with those. I've wanted Mad World for a while, so now with that and Epic Mickey, I, I think I have a reason to plug in my Wii again. Um, Hopefully, I still got a lot of 360 games I need to complete. Um, I would also like to bounce back and play uh, Heavy Rain again on my PS3. So we'll see what happens. Um, but yeah, I got a pretty good good amount of stuff today. So that's probably all the shopping I'm going to do for a little while. But um pretty content with all that. So yeah, that's my recent purchases. Haven't really gotten anything else between then and Christmas. Um, have I? No, not really. So, that's pretty much it. I've been broke the past couple weeks, so I haven't really been able to do anything. But, um, so yeah, that's really all that's been, uh, that I've gotten. I'm going to leave you with the second of my two, um, little videos that were made using Kinect Sports. This one was also made right after Christmas, on Christmas Day, actually. We didn't show this one with the last episode, so we'll show it with this one. Um, so go ahead and check that out, and that's going to do it. So uh, I'm Chris, Big C. I'll see you later. Thank you for watching, and enjoy the little short.